uh, I mean, for instance, that if a radar operator reports an unidentified object on his scope, the Air Force would take appropriate action to attempt to determine its identity and certainly to ensure that it isn't a threat to our national security. Uh, this is the way it was before Blue Book and certainly is the same since the project was canceled. Uh, with the public clamoring for information and also with uh, the consideration that these sightings could indeed possibly represent air or craft or spacecraft of some sort, the, the DOD assigned responsibility to the Air Force to continue investigations of these sightings is beyond the real-time determination that they don't constitute a threat to our country. Now, that's what Blue Book was to do, and that was the way I understood my job. The project, when established, uh, actually expanded its investigation to cover sightings reported by the general public. The mission of the organization, as I understood it and the way in which I conducted it when I was there, was to investigate these things, collect as much information as you possibly could, then to have an analysis performed by some agency that was a specialist, if it required specialist attention, or to conduct an analysis, and then to provide the kind of information as to uh, what actually caused the occurrence to the Air Force Information Service so that they would have it available if and when someone uh, asked questions regarding that particular sighting and or to publish information on that particular site. We did operate with a very small staff and at one time uh, uh, I did get it expanded uh, considerably but uh, it wasn't long before it went back down to its normal size. When a mission doesn't fit an organization, it's, it usually is distorted, you know, in an effort to make it fit, okay? There's supposed to be coordination throughout the intelligence community, all right? But I'm sure that, uh, that there's probably some information that they just feel uh, is uh, something that that particular service ought to keep, and consequently it just doesn't get out. I... But how can you say that because, uh, you know, unless you really and truthfully know about it, it's quite possible that we have been visited by uh, the extraterrestrial uh, craft and or that we will be. Uh, but I still think even further that there's possibly some scientific pay dirt in all these things. And this scientific pay dirt, I feel, should uh, be exploited if, if possible. And the only way you're going to be able to do that is to really get some concentrated effort on it. I think that what Heineck is doing with his organization back there, the Center for Youthful Studies, is really and truly trying to fill the gap that was left when Blue Book was canceled. But uh, he certainly can't match a government-funded effort. Uh, there's no way.